Hello Capricorn and welcome to your uh, weekly coffee cup reading for August 1st and um, I'm going to be trying to do these every Friday so I'm glad you're here hope you enjoy it anyhow here is your cup so you can see it still not good with my camera so bear with me well what I'm sensing here there's a there's not really a theme. There's just a um, few things happening here. So let's just start off from the get-go. First of all, I want to say there's almost a complete ring on here. So something that is dear to, dear to your heart or some kind of wish is almost fulfilled. Not quite, but it's at the process of being filled. You may not even believe it will, but it's, or, you know, some kind of emotional issue is going to be resolving itself. Anyway, um, in the home here, not in a home, but I'm looking here about work or also your career, your status. But what I'm seeing that's significant is a uh, two M's, like M and M's, you know, the um, M. Like um, here we go. You could see it. I don't know if you can see it. I have a hard time reading. They're here and it's over here. Um, double M. So whatever that means to you. Again, um, not again, but. You have two threes, so something three days, uh, three weeks, um, three months, threes, double threes, 33, something significant here, and a double M. Um, also, I, I could look at the, it could be a water sign, Scorpio could be very significant in your life, or there's some kind of Scorpion, Scorpionic influence, with, like with the eighth house of Scorpio, death, rebirth kind of feel going on here. Um, there's a lot, um, I see some endings, new beginnings, comings. Now, um, if you, okay, you have a car showing up. So it is telling me that either you're thinking of purchasing a car in that I may wait a little or, uh, watch out that you don't get a ticket, get told something to a little in the yellow and your car is showing up. So, or if you want a car and you don't have one, you may have to wait a little. Maybe it's even better that you do. There's also a cross here with a little bird, which is telling you that you're either going to be dwelling into your religious beliefs or becoming more spiritual or you're um, going to be studying something. But it's um, whatever your beliefs are. It's, it's a belief system that you're um, working on. And let's see here. What else do I see? You do have, hmm, well, there is a little bit of um, worry. You have you have a big fish that is some um, you have a, a major concern. Um, could be something about your home, your you know your personal life here. And let's see here. Also, just looking really quick here. All right. You do have a witch, and there is also Al next to what it's telling me that you may find a clever way of resolving some kind of issue. You may also have, um, there is stress showing me here that you may not be sleeping well, or you're still concerned about some kind of um, problem that's been really keeping you up. Again, um, resolution could be on its way, but... Um, don't see that yet so i'm not going to say that that's what's happening here the um the other thing that i want to say is you do also have a a turtle that's telling me that things are slowly slowly coming or resolving themselves it's taking its time also hmm, well that's all that's popping out there is some Decisions that you want to make, maybe about the home or personal situation. So that's all I see right there. And then your plate here. Um, the plate sometimes will say something, sometimes it won't. What it is telling me is you're a burden, burdens that you've been carrying and that by the time the full moon is coming in, some of that's going to be shifted or you're going to have some kind of resolution or things are going to start moving um, if things were stagnant. So the next um, new moon is, I believe, August 2nd. Yeah, in Leo. So 
that's all that says there. So if you do like, if you did like the um, coffee cup reading, please do like, share, and subscribe. And let's see next week what shows up for you Capricorns. Anyway, um, please like, share, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Bye, Capricorns.